These are some Dinar Guru updates, starting off with Militia Man. Militia Man says, I think as far as everything being in the place where Iraq is concerned with their reinstatement time frame, I think the writing is on the wall. They're going to go into the international financial system. We also expect to see the new small category notes, lower denominations released in Iraq. And I'm hoping this will happen in the next short period of time. Mountain Goat says we have learned that the CBI is targeting a new revalued rate for the dinar of 1132 from 1320. And very soon, this is their target, and we know it is. Is this the last rate change we are looking for prior to the one-to-one coming revaluation and triggering the project to delete the zeros? Just be patient. The reinstatement is coming. Frank26 Firefly says, uh, Sudani on television again saying, In the coming days we will see the overthrow of the major corrupt. This is what we think is the final part to cut the head off the snake. My bank friend told me this is the part we're looking for next. And then we get what we want. Frank says you can trust Sidani to cut the head off that snake. All right, Claire, article quote, uh, World Bank, Iraq's economy is fragile and its debts have risen to $152 billion. Um, says Claire says no, another quote, noting that the central bank auction caused the redirection of hard currency to the parallel market, which led to a decrease in the value of the dinar against the dollar. Militia Man says, I believe there was an article from the courts that Iraq had 30 days from July 26 for the budget to be implemented and for them to start spending. For them to start spending, it's a heck of a lot cheaper to buy things to rebuild with at least a rate of $1 than $13.10. Whatever rate they come out at, I believe it will be strong. Alak has said he is not going to float the currency, suggesting it's going to be a strong rate. All right, Pimpy says, I know a lot of you are eagerly waiting for the announcement that the exchange rate is massively jumped up to this large number because this budget can't function without a large exchange rate. I'm saying that's BS. Frank26, uh, why isn't there a lot of article information this past week? Why? Frank says, it's on the down low side right now on purpose. You'll see. All right, Mark Z is referencing Militia Man's post and says the most important timing that he, Militia Man, mentioned with Al Sadani and the expectations to have money flowing by the 26th. A lot of folks in Iraq, involved with Iraq, believe this could mean a change in value. All right, Walking Stick says um, Aki's Iraqi bank report, all the banks are back online. The ones they did not give license to will be under the. Uh, Tutelage of the CBI. No more messing around. Banks, machines have been set up. We've done everything that the CBI has requested of us. We do not know of any other meetings that are scheduled with the CBI. All that we are waiting for is the exchange rate now. All right, Militia Man says, uh, Federal Court specified their own timelines. They specifically stated 30 days from July 26 that the 2023, 24, 25 budget has to be implemented by that date. That's 30 days. All right, Nader from the Mideast says, as long as they, the Iraqis, have money and they can buy and sell stuff, they don't pay attention to it, the Dinar RV. That guy's going to have $1 million in his pocket or 1500 It's going to be the same thing. It's going to spend the same thing. In the United States and Europe too, they talk about it. All over the world they talk about because they know it's going to happen. It's an investment for the outsiders. But for the Iraqis, it's not an investment. Over there, if we change the currency, all we have to do is take that $2 million, change them to $2 millions with small categories. All right, Frank26 says corruption in Iraq is being dismantled, and that's what we need to have the new exchange rate. They stepped on the gas, hundreds of people being arrested, millions and millions of dinar being brought back to Iraq. This is all part of the monetary reform. And lastly, Militia Man says, my take is a float won't work in a digital world. I just don't see it. I think they're going to make an adjustment to their re- real effective exchange rate, the rear, and I hope and expect it will be better than it was in a previous era. When I first got into this, the IMF had them shut down from $3.22. So when they reinstate, I think they will start there, maybe add some for inflation, and they probably will do a managed float. 